As we begin Black History Month, we are celebrating notable black Houstonians like Vanessa Gilmore. She was the youngest person to ever serve on the federal bench when she was appointed in 1994 by President Bill Clinton. And now after nearly 30 years as a U.S. District Judge here in Houston, Gilmore is now hanging up her robe and putting down her gavel. KPRC 2's Sian Rhodes sat down with Judge Gilmore for a look back at her incredible career and a look ahead to now what's next. Sian. And Keith and Christine, the now former federal judge Vanessa Gilmore, Gilmore is just three weeks into what she says isn't retirement, but a refirement, igniting new passions and finding new ways to serve. Law school was not part of the plan. Vanessa Gilmore arrived in Houston as a 20 year old college graduate. Moved here to become a fashion buyer at Foley's department store. But after successfully suing her apartment complex for theft, she enrolled in the University of Houston's law school in 1979 setting her on a course toward history. And it was really the first year that there was a critical mass of women that were attending law school at the University of Houston. There were less than nine black students altogether and just a handful of black women. She was enjoying a successful career as a Houston trial lawyer when in 1994 she was appointed by President Bill Clinton to become a United States District Court judge making her the youngest person to serve on the federal bench at that time. I think I sort of got voluntold that I was going to become a federal judge. She went through a daunting 13-month-long confirmation process. To talk about people turning over every rock in your entire life. As she steps away from her federal judgeship, she's closely watching the process to select the first black woman to serve on the Supreme Court. Every single one of them is supremely qualified to serve as a Supreme Court justice. Her life outside the courtroom included a commitment to community service and a decision at age 44 to adopt a baby boy. That baby that I adopted uh, back in 2001 is now 21 years old. He's just been uh, the joy of my life. Now as she starts a new passion project. Then I'm going to be opening a tea room on Riverside Drive called Tea with Judge V. She's grateful reflecting on a career she didn't plan for. It was not a job that I would have picked for myself, but it is the job that was really suited to my personality. I think it's one of those things where if you want to make God laugh, you tell him your plans because it has been an amazing career that I've felt completely blessed to have. And with a lifetime appointment, Judge Vanessa Gilmore could have stayed on the bench for many more years. But as you see, she has a lot more life to live outside of the federal courthouse. No word yet on who her replacement will be. Keith and Christine, back to you. Tea with Judge V. I love We're ready. Yeah, there we go. Amazing All right. career. Thank yeah. you, Sion.